Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create XML file with the help of Ruby NoCoGuery Jam. So first thing, install NoCoGuery Jam on your machine. Type in jam install NoCoGuery. Once you do that, you can execute the code in this tutorial. Now, open text editor. Type in demo.rb as your file name or you can save it with any other name of your choice. Now, call for require no query. And next thing to do is create one document with name XML doc, or you can simply go with XML, whichever is your choice. Then call for no query XML class, then call for builder dot new. Okay, and here you will simply have your XML array that will hold the content okay so for that we will use XML dot body then within do loop we will have XML dot node one where we have our message then second XML dot node two as email then we will have one more node xml node 3 and for that we will have one more sub node as xml dot node 3 1 and point 2 email okay now once we come out of this we will also close our this loop as end Okay, so once we do that, all we have to do is convert this variable to XML. So we will use dot to underscore XML. Now, all we have to do is use puts XML. Okay, now we can test this out immediately on console. So open console, go to the directory where you have that file stored, type it Ruby, then name of your file dot rb hit enter and you will find the content that we just created now if you want to export this to let's say a specific named xml then you use file dot open then let's name this file as devnami dot xml then open it in write mode okay then outside that within curly bracket we'll have our array of file to write okay so f dot write and let's pass on our xml content and that is pretty much it so if we execute the code again that should show you the same content with file created okay now let's go to the directory where I have this file okay now let's go and check it shows devnabi.xml okay let me open that to show you how it looks so here you see the same content that we passed is now created here okay so this is the XML file that we just created with the help of nokogiri gem in Ruby Okay, so you can pause the video and go through this code and try this on your own. 